Barra here, coming at you from the AMC Century City. I just walked out from watching Venom The Last Dance, and my initial thoughts are, I had I had a blast with it. I had a lot of fun with it, with this um, that entry into the Venom um, trilogy. Frankly, I was expecting to walk into the movie theater expecting some dumb fun, some action, some hilarious moments, and uh, that's what I got. Uh, it, it, it delivered in that sense. Additionally, it also has a couple of heartfelt uh, moments that I was not expecting <laughs> um, to fall for. But it also has some very cliche, some eye rolling inducing dialogue and scenarios that again, it's part of what a Venom uh, movie is. So I did not walk into the movie expecting to watch the new or the latest Best Picture Academy Award winner or nominee. So I knew what I was getting myself into. It delivered in that sense in every way. Tom Hardy once again, and he makes this role work. Um, He makes me believe that he generally has a symbiote within him and he is struggling with this dual identity, but also at the same time in this film, he's wholeheartedly embraced it. And it's pretty fun to see a literal like buddy comedy uh, within uh, this film and it works. Uh, Tom Hardy makes it work. And I had fun. Uh, it's two hours of, of fun and action and, and a, an adventure that has a couple of, of moving moments, but it also can be a little frustrating with its generic um, approach and some uh, some just cheesy dialogue that just makes you uh, <laughs> not necessarily enjoy those little aspects of it. Um, I think the positives definitely outweigh the negatives in this case. And just like every other Venom movie that I've watched and had a really good time seeing, this one falls within the the previous two. Obviously, the first one is still my favorite one. And uh, it delivered. Um, it, it delivered very much in that sense. So... Again, as of now, I think I'm giving it a three out of five or a six out of ten. And uh, yeah, don't, don't, don't not walk into the film expecting a a Dune part two kind of movie or a, a movie that's just perfect in every sense of the word. It's not. This is just some fun, uh, a popcorn flick with dumb fun scenarios. And it, for that aspect, it, it works very well. So yeah, those are my initial thoughts for now. Stay tuned for my written review where I will elaborate further on what worked and did not work for me. So keep an eye out on that uh, over at thelatinoslant.com. Until next time, talk to y'all later. Bye.